In this video, we are going to solve this factorial problem 10 factorial is equal to 6 factorial times x factorial and we have to find the value of the x which satisfy this factorial equation. Let us solve this. We can write it as 10 factorial is equal to 6 factorial times x factorial. Now, on dividing both sides by 6 factorial, we get 10 factorial divided by 6 factorial is equal to 6 factorial times x factorial divided by 6 factorial. Now, we can cancel out this 6 factorial by this 6 factorial and which implies our remaining terms are 10 factorial divided by 6 factorial is equal to x factorial. Now, in the next step, uh, we can open this uh, uh, 10 factorial and 6 factorial and we get 10 time 9 time 8 time 7 time 6 time 5 time 4 time uh, 3 time 2 time 1 and uh, divided by 6 factorial can be written as a 6 time of 5 time 4 time 3 time 2 time 1 is equal to x factorial no we can cancel uh, this 6 by this 6, this 5 by this 5, this 4 by this 4, this 3 by this 3, this 2 by this 2 and this 1, this 1. Now our remaining terms are 10 times 9 times 8 times 7 is equal to x factorial. Now in the next step uh, we can factorize uh, this term uh, in uh, as 10 factorial can be written as a 5 times 2 it become 10 and 9 can be written as a 3 times 3 8 can be written as a 2 times 2 times 2 and 7 can be written as 7 it is a prime is equal to x factorial now in the next step we can write it as a 7 can be written as a 7 time no, we can uh, write it as uh, 5 as it is. We can combine uh, this 2 and this 3. We can write it as uh, 2 times 3. Time 3 as it is. And a uh, time uh, we can combine uh, these 2. 2 times 2. 2 times 2. And uh, 2 as it is is equal to x factorial. No, we have 7 time 5 time 3 times 2 it becomes 6 time 3 time 2 times 2 it becomes 4 times 2 and times 1 we can write is equal to x factorial no in the descending order we can write it as a 7 time uh, we can write a 6 time 5 time 4 time 3 time 2 time 1 is equal to x factorial which implies uh, this can be written as a 7 factorial is equal to x factorial which implies 7 is equal to x or we can write it as x is equal to 7 thus the value of the x is equal to 7 which satisfy our given factorial problem uh, if you are new here make sure that you have to subscribe our channel for more informative videos See you in the next video. Till then, bye.